Uh, Amazon is hitting pause on its police used facial recognition software uh, as the company continues to take a stance in the Black Lives Matter movement. Yahoo Finance Tech uh, editor Dan Halley is here with the details. Dan? Yeah, so Amazon is putting a one year moratorium on the use of its recognition, recognition with a K, facial recognition technology but, uh, used by police forces, uh, law enforcement agencies. Uh, Amazon really hasn't been uh, very clear as to how many agencies are using the software or where exactly they're located. There's been reports, obviously, that there was one in Orlando, Florida uh, that was using it. But this is a big change. And we have uh, this coming on the heels of, obviously, the racial equality protests or inequality protests, rather, uh, and uh, the um, death of George Floyd. Uh, and so this is an interesting time for Amazon to be doing this because there have been criticisms about recognition showing a bias towards people of color before. It's not as if this is something new. So this is clearly a move on their part to ensure that they're able to uh, kind of answer to the, the PR issue that this raises. Uh, and then obviously overseas, we have those issues with Amazon now seemingly facing antitrust issues because of their treatment of third party sellers. That's something that has been brought up as well here in the US, uh, whether or not they use data from third party sellers to create their own products and then sell those to compete against those third party sellers. The third party sellers don't really have any choice to work with, uh, but to work with Amazon since there's such a large marketplace. You know, Dan, uh, just earlier in the week, uh, I think it was this week, uh, IBM said that it would no longer develop or research uh, its facial recognition software. What does the future look like, do you think, for that software? You know, a number of companies, big name companies like IBM and Amazon, you know, poured a lot of money into that effort. Yeah, and it's uh, it's not just them. It's uh, Microsoft is also uh, in there as far as facial recognition goes. Uh, they said that they have turned down agencies uh, as well as countries uh, in the past who wanted to use their facial recognition technology. Uh, a lot of these companies say that they are used to help find missing and exploited children. Uh, that's something that Amazon will continue to do. Uh, and facial rec recognition technology is something that we use on a daily basis. If you have a new iPhone uh, or a new Android phone, uh, they both have facial recognition technologies built into them. So it is a technology that's going to continue to be used. But as far as the in the law enforcement space, uh, it'll be interesting to see what happens here. You'll remember there is that controversial company, Clearview AI, that was scraping people's Facebook photos to be able to match with potential criminals. Uh, I reached out to them. They said that they are not going to uh, issue a moratorium on their use of their product for uh, law enforcement. So they'll still be in the business as well. Yeah, Dan, uh, Dan, I'm so over this facial recognition software. My iPhone still doesn't recognize me with my mask on. But uh, <laughs> let's leave it there. Dan Halley, thanks so much. Hey, investors. Zach Guzman here. Are you interested in learning more about the markets and getting the latest financial news? Well, then click right here to subscribe to our Yahoo Finance YouTube channel. Get the latest up-to-the-minute market analysis, big interviews in the world of finance, and information on how to manage your money every day wherever you are.